hello everyone i have brought uh, another wonderful tutorial for you people today and in this tutorial we are going to learn how we can create the editable form uh, in pdf format using adobe indesign so basically let's get started uh, i'm just importing the form that i have created so this form you can create in adobe photoshop adobe indesign adobe illustrator it does not matter the final output is the pdf that we are using here okay so as you can see in this form uh, we need to make it online and editable so when we send it to the customer it simply fills these text field and send us back we can also incorporate the tick button in the same form so let's see how we can do that so first of all you have placed the form and i have locked the form okay so whatever we are going to do it will be placed over the form so select the rectangle frame tool from here okay and let's create this as a checkbox okay create a rectangular frame right click on it go to interactive and convert to checkbox okay so we can keep it normally off okay so when the user click on it it will be checked checkbox will be enabled okay in the same way uh, let's make this field editable for the user so again select the rectangle tool and create box like that and again right click go to interactive and convert to button okay and from here you can let's make it a text field okay let's make it a text field and from here you can also adjust the font that will be used by the user when sending you back you can also adjust the font size that the user will uh, input okay now and let's change this to regular okay it's just a hit and trial for now we can adjust it by while having a look at the final output so you do not need to convert again and again the buttons once you have make the text field like this simply control c and control v and just place it where you want to place everything will be automatically enabled again doing the same control c control v or using the alt key and just drag it it will also create a duplicate layer so you can make text boxes like this okay so we have done everything to make the form interactive here is the checkbox and these are the text fields so let's have a look at the output go to file go to export and select pdf interactive and let's save it with the name form export okay now the form has been opened as you can see in this manner the form will be sent to the user when it opens it and he will be easily be able to enter the text he will also be able to mark the check or remove the check if it does not exist or we can also write name over here as i told you we can also change the font size and font uh, style depending on your requirement so it can be easily done that so once the user had input his information in the form he will simply save it and send back to you so it is very much easier to create an editable pdf form i hope you like this story